this decided. Welcome back to the Gentleman's Den. Jeff, Frankie, and Sean back once again to hopefully get you through a shitty day. Boys. Yeah. Another, sh- another shitty day? Boys. Fuck, man. I have a you? shit day every day after work. That's my well, When you come home, you're finding that <laughs> work when you come home, it's a shitty day. Huh? No, that's when I shit. Oh, okay. I shit Makes after sense. work. <laughs> but he doesn't throat. shit while oh, he's working. No. I don't shit places, bro. Hey, I never even, public like, public? have the urge to shit when I'm not at home. Like, my butthole knows, <laughs> not here, bro. <laughs> Wait till we get home. Once bro. I pass the front door, it's like, all right, balls, start moving. You could feel like as soon as you get in your car to drive home, it starts like it knows. Hey, it knows. I've been it's good be all home. day. <laughs> Not me, bro. You know when you get home. Sean, you, you big shit at work? Dude, I I get paid to shit. Yeah, you're all about those uh, extra. <laughs> yeah, extra, you're getting paid by the hour. Vacation so time. <laughs> There was some a meme or something funny where it said if you shit at work for a, uh, f- at least fifteen minutes every day, like it adds up to like seven days of vacation. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I feel like that's totally worth it then. Totally. I feel like I used to be. Well, maybe not seven math. days. But you figure fifteen minutes a day for a week. I was gonna I mean, say I was gonna do that. How much my head math is that? I, dude, I'm not very well, good Well, I work anymore. a four day. I work a four day a week, so it'd only be week. an hour. So it's an hour. An hour a an week. Hour a so week. 52 hours. Yeah. So a Three day. A, a, a 52 hours is uh, one week. So there, you so, get a week. <laughs> you get a week's vacation a just week for taking paid 15 minutes out for yourself. Yeah, this That's be on the learning bro. channel. I'm hey. just saying, bro. Damn, yeah, we're just dropping that knowledge. Just knowledge. Anyone yeah, a whole thanks. Just out there? I'm I'm hoping my bosses are listening so I get fired once I walk in. Okay, like, <laughs> shit in. in those like, shit in. Here's your paperwork. Get so long. <laughs> Why didn't you finish Docking this? you a week pay. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the fucking podcast with all the other 12 people that watched it. I saw it. Hey, man. Too good. A week pay. Hey, man. We've been over in fucking 15 I love countries, every one bro. of our 12 followers. That are 16 followers. 16 countries? Have we really been to 16 yeah. countries? Ooh. There's that many people that are that bored? Yeah. Jeez. Yeah, people shit a lot at work. Yeah, <laughs> buddy. <laughs> That's they what they're doing on the 15 shit. minutes. <laughs> <laughs> if you listen to 15 minutes. Bro, our podcast an hour long. Can... Right. They can break it down into sections. (laughs) (laughs) Like cutting a turd. Breaking it down into sections. That's why our YouTube videos, our clips are going to be 15 minutes long. (laughs) (laughs) Minimum of 15 minutes. I feel like that's the perfect slot. I mean, 15 minutes, I feel like that's when people start asking where you're at. You know what I mean? Fuck Sean. You seen him? I don't know. Like five minutes ago, he was over there. You got to wipe quick. Nah. Back to work, bro. Huh? I, no, I, you got to you gotta wipe. You you can, like, wipe and sit there longer, but you don't want to not wipe and sit there, and then you're scraping concrete off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't take a 15 minute shit You used to work at a warehouse for 20 years. I yeah, am. so I used to shit at really work do there. do do this. I'm sure of it. I don't have yeah. time. I'm always getting paid. I, I go to take a piss, and it's like, right, got a cousin in the front of my fuck. You need a better job. Uh, See, when you get a job, then job right one now. of those works again. Now you tell them I want an extra week's pay because I don't shit. <laughs> <laughs> All I right, no check it out. Shit. I, want I usually <laughs> ask for two weeks vacation, <laughs> but I don't shit at work, so I need at least three weeks. <laughs> Unfortunately, kind of unfortunately, I just turned down two director jobs. Uh, 
Just yeah. taking care of the fam. It's just not the time. You got plenty of time to work. Right. Right now? At least you have the option. I am working. Working, working on, on this buzz. buzz. I did this great mural behind me. You guys yeah, look at this mural good. I painted. Good job. I'm very right? impressed. Like For our listeners, go to the yeah. YouTube. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Watch it there. Check out the YouTube. Yeah, check it out. Frankie has Why a beautiful he, I, uh, I mural tell. that he uh, may or may not have painted. Or Yeah. What was that, about 17 years ago? I'm getting emotional. Throw up? Getting emotional. Oh. Okay. So it looks like the same face you make when you throw up, so yep. I was just... <laughs> I was just a little concerned. Sorry. It's a beautiful mural. I drew when was it, the last way. time you threw a fuck off? No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Fuck off. Fuck off. <laughs> Stop fucking around, cunt. When was the last time you threw up? I've never thrown up. That's a lie. <laughs> I've seen it. I've held your mullet I've... back for you. Sean, I, was, gonna be okay? I, remember I was, I was uh, DJing at this bar, and I puked all over the DJ booth. <laughs> Just got DJed? John. Oh, fuck, bro. <laughs> I'm like, grab I'm that shirt. Sure. Grab that shirt. Dude, he <laughs> seemed... It up with a... The crazy part about that is he seemed fine. I was fine. He, he was working. Seems fine. He was working, and all of a sudden he just... <laughs> My shot didn't go down well, and then I told Frankie to get me another we I kept drinking. Say, I'm pretty I sure know, I that stepped was stepped in. That was a fluke accident. You just got to puke and keep drinking. Unlike Frankie, uh, who will puke in your car door. Or, I, I remember our buddy, our buddy Dave, we're fucking, he felt like shit. We're out partying. It's like two in the morning. He leans over his railing, <laughs> fucking <laughs> just makes himself puke. And he's looking at it. He's like, I knew I shouldn't have had that hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> Oh fuck! It wasn't all the booze and whatever else he was doing. <laughs> no, was it out wasn't out. the ecstasy. Now it was the angle. I'm gonna fucking go back to drinking. Oh, dude, it was a hundred percent that scene, Sean. <laughs> it wasn't the ecstasy. It was the yeah. egg rolls. <laughs> I knew I shouldn't add that hot dog. <laughs> I feel like this is the first time I've drank since I got that lake. It feels good. <laughs> Oh, shit. Congrats, bro. Welcome back to the drinking community. Never stopped over Whoa. Here, Let me tell you. You guys just froze on my screen and looked crazy. I'm too high for that. Yeah, we... Oh. That's whatever. I'm sorry for our listeners. I can't take these earbuds out in time. Where's the mute button? For what? I just belched in their ears. That's just oh. rude. I barely even noticed it, so you're good. Yeah, because you got no manners and you call yourself part of the gentleman's den. You know, gentlemen. He's wearing a Canadian no tuxedo, sir. They're the nicest Look at that. people turn, in the I world. Turn the, I turn the exhaust <laughs> fan on when I shit. Up. I'm a gentleman as fuck. It's a true sign like of that's, a gentleman. Just, that's just being selfish and you don't want to be sitting in your own stink. I, I get it. No. Jot upon it my, off like you're caring my for ladies, others. My lady is like getting ready. We're like getting ready to go out. And I know this. Looking in the mirror and so you're I go sitting take there watching her shit. shit. And then she wants to get ready for the night out. And all her makeup and all her straighteners is melting in because of Jeff's fucking toxic <laughs> ass. And she bangs on the... I live for this moment when she bangs <laughs> on the door and said, You're not shitting, are you? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, she always knows. Yes, I am. Uh, five o'clock, isn't it? Jeff, Jeffrey. Jeff <gasps> knows. Well, who wants to put their fucking makeup on and... Straighten their hair. The death. The death oh, fog. So, oh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> There's still always a linger. So, I think like every guy lives for that do. moment, though. Don't they? Probably. Yeah. Jack you know, you know, like your lady's like, we haven't gone out in forever, and you know, we're going out with all her girlfriends, and she's <laughs> gearing up, and you better not fuck this up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you drop the ball. And then you go in there and you take a huge shit and she's about to get ready. <laughs> she walks into that I feel bathroom. like it's planned. It has to like be planned. It is planned. I know exactly what time she's going to start getting ready. Jeff's got a timer on his watch. 
And he doesn't She's wear like, oh, a watch. She's like, oh, it's 6 o'clock. I'm going to have to jump corner. in the shower soon. Yeah. Hold He's up, just, man. uh... Oh my God. She's looking around the corner, creeping. She getting about to get ready, or? All right, I'm gonna run up there and shit. <laughs> Pretty much. You just know. And it's time, you know. I feel like that's why you save it all day for those moments. That's what you look right. for. That's what I look that's for. Those are your hobbies. It's a passion. It's a passion, really. Passion I have many project. passions. Dicks for passion. nickels and shitting before my girlfriend gets ready. <laughs> I mean, those are pretty good ones. Just saying. Pretty good. The nickel dicks is a joke that is on our YouTube video Jeff is going to eventually put up. Yeah. Yeah. Watch yeah. That. That's well, there's a podcast. Call. Jeez, there's a podcast. Go look. A I think podcast. we have a podcast um, episode called Who YouTube Gave You videos? the Nickel? No. Yeah. We have YouTube videos too? Yeah, we do. Who gave me the nickel? All of them. That's just... (laughs) (laughs) I miss you guys. This quarantine sucks. Fuck, it sucks. I miss you guys too. I'm glad we're back doing this. I needed this. I needed this. This beer. I was talking about the beer. What are you guys talking about? I just been sitting here, <laughs> sitting here with my headphones on, rocking and crying, just listening to this over and over, it? over and over again. Want to touch it? Want to touch just, it? <laughs> he plays that before it. he Wanna plays that before it? he beats up. <laughs> he pretends his penis says it. Want to touch it? And he goes, "Yes, <laughs> yes penis." Yes, I do. <laughs> well, my dick does some stupid things, so it does remind me you of what, Frankie. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's a pretty good uh I mean if there was like I'm kind of like an accent, like kind of like a little little gangster, little Italian, little little slide of, you know, some essay in there, that's exactly what your penis would sound like. Yeah. You wanna touch it? <laughs> All day. No, I told you later. Fuck. Listen, guy. I got to work over here. You just stay down there and relax. What do you think those 15 minutes are in the bathroom for? No. It's calling Geico. That's so that. he could save 15%. <laughs> yeah. Not a sponsor. Not a sponsor. <laughs> yes, not a sponsor. And no, I'm not manscaping with their what new you lawnmower. For so long, Frank, you care to explain yourself? I was saving money on my car. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you guys are losers paying high premiums. I'm just saying, if Geico wants to sponsor us, well, I don't know. we could sit down and talk. Right I got time right now. I'm a progressive but time. man. Me and they Flo. compare Listen, rates man. with other places. Me and Flo like, are Geico. like this, son. You and Flo are like. Well, I feel like you'd be uh, tighter with Jamie. <laughs> you guys seem like an interesting man, though. All those places and that hot wife. And he could play I, a mean guitar. That's Can all you I play want, the my guitar? insurance agent. What's in the guitar case? <laughs> yeah, guitar. Guitar. Can your insurance agent nothing. play a guitar? Can Jake at State Farm play the guitar? I fucking bet you not. He plays the guitar like that Esteban dude that used to sell guitars <laughs> at 4 o'clock in the morning on the infomercials. Uh, don't really know. Awesome, Jake from man. State Farm's fucking jacked. He's, got, he's b- pushing out the commercials now with Mahomes and Rogers. Yeah, they made, nice they, they, made, they made Jake get in the gym. And they're like, yeah, like hey. nah, white, nah, white dude, you, you, white Jake, you stay in the khakis and keep answering the phones. We're gonna send this guy <laughs> out. Yeah, what happened to that Jake? He just was like, yo, wouldn't I that suck if you were that money. guy? If I was that guy, just bitching at my agent, like, bro, we had it. <laughs> it was, we had it was this. right Jake. here, right I'm here. Jake from State Jake. Farm. What the hell did you do? Aaron Rodgers and Patrick Mahomes just kicking it, eating steaks, ketchup and shit. Right. Looks awesome. Oh, that. That commercial just bothers me. I'm when Mahomes is just fucking loading the ketchup on the food, steak. Yeah. How dare him? him? He was in another money. commercial where he was putting ketchup on steaks. 
Oh. I think it was like a FanDuel one or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, uh, really and that, that's actually something. <laughs> yeah, that's a thing. And people were oh. saying, do you think that he got slided in the draft a few draft picks because of his uh, They found that out. That's why the Yeah, they were like, this motherfucker puts ketchup on steaks. We can't trust him. Not in Chicago. Ketchup. Does he eat you that shit well done, too? Dog. Does he eat it well done, too? I'm not that know. much of a I don't think so. Deep if you ate it I well done, I mean, I've been gambling too, a lot, but I've been watching what they've been eating. I am glad they didn't I'll draft him. Up. I don't care how many Super Bowls and MVPs he wins. If he's putting ketchup on a well-done steak. He's he, a psychopath. He's, he's going to he's gonna, some He's going to murder somebody. <laughs> well, maybe, honestly, maybe that's why they didn't draft him in Chicago, because he probably put right. ketchup on his hot dog. Right. And they, they, no fly down there. they will kill him. They will kill him in the shot. The same. I've seen. I've seen old ladies slap people. It's true. Can you imagine yeah, him at? Back of the head. Can you imagine him at Wiener Circle asking for fucking ketchup? You guys got some ketchup? He's got that, that sounds you know. like a gay club. The Wiener Circle. <laughs> it's fucking. You get swore at at ten a.m. <laughs> that sounds like the fucking dance floor at a gay strip club. Oh, dude, that would be the best gay club bar name or whatever. What are they called? I feel like that's their, I feel like that was wrong. You but motherfuckers call yourself Chicagoans circle. and you never went to the Wiener Circle. No, I've been to I Super mean, Dogs. Super Dogs is kind of as far as I need to go. You never been yeah, to Jeans and Juice? Places? Jeans. Uh, I don't think so. I've been to Hot Dogs, uh, which is no longer there. Toots is no longer there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so many places. Our small businesses, people. I'm a, I don't like anything on the Chicago hot dog. I'll be honest. <laughs> they got, how's their cheese? I'll get a cheese dog. Mike Manis, how's the cheese? Yeah. yeah. Only another jean jacket wearer would understand. I feel like you borrowed that jacket from Mantis. You no, probably I want it money. back. I paid good money for this. I can't. I, you should be slapped that you paid money. You go to Goodwill and find that for a dollar fifty. Yeah, he found it at Goodwill. It had a pack of Marlboro Reds in the yeah. one pocket, and a nineteen eighty seven rubber in the bro. other. Covered oh. jizz. <laughs> Did you shove like, all in your seventies firebird? Bad decisions. <laughs> It'd be a great dude. Wouldn't that be a great idea if you like were an Uber driver? Like I just dressed like this, and I had a fucking Trans Am. <laughs> Only if you played nothing but Billy Squire and Ario Speedwagon. That's what I'm saying. Wasn't that I a meme? Like that... I just saw that, and I was like, that might be the greatest idea ever. Why not? Why and you I'm, willing, I'm willing to do it. You're laid off in the winners, you'll have extra time. Trans Am's got no know. traction in the snow. <laughs> yeah, you can't drive that you in the winter. You how much fun a Trans Am would be in the snow? You'd be fishtailing all over the fucking place. I'll have to do a redneck oh, style. Where I like jack it up and get four wheel drive on it. Or you just get a four wheel drive S10 and write Trans Am on the hood and slap a <laughs> and paint the Phoenix. Slap the Phoenix on there. <laughs> I feel like you, you look like you could have a jacked up Ford F150. <laughs> that mullet and those sunglasses. Woo! Come on, honey, you need a ride. Oh no, nah, he's a bow tie man. He's a Silverado man. I look like I hunted last weekend. It was widow widow's weekend. Dear widow's weekend. That's like the if I was a single dude, I guess that would be the time to go to the club. Widow's weekend. All the dudes are in the woods hunting. And their ladies are at the club dancing. What does that mean? I thought you were talking about like all these people go there after their husbands die. I'm like, damn, no. now they got all these rich women single women. No, widow's weekend is it's where all the dudes Dear go Widow's to the woods. Weekend. Dear Widow's Weekend. On Widow's Weekend? Dear I'm confused. Widow. Dear Widow's so you Weekend. You can hit up the club. All the dudes go hunting. Their bitches are at home with no cock. So they go what, to the club. What time of year is this? Drinking champagne. Right now. Maybe bottle service where they got the sparklers. They bring it to your table. You rub ice on your nipples. You listen to a little bit of Ludacris, and who even knows? <laughs> Whoa, Michael that just Holman. that just Dude. took a fucking Small journey right there. Inside, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Sounds like a good time to me. Good. Wait, what? That just took me on a journey. The sink was just activated. Like a song? Or like Yes, like a song, Frankie. 
You like Journey. I know that. So I know you're gay. I never stop believing. <sighs> White Sox. <sucks. gasps> oh, there's so much good music that's been out, but I couldn't tell you one song. I don't know names of stuff. Frankie, I don't, did you I don't you know think it? that's one of their songs. Did you hear that? Did you listen you to that song You ever heard that I Journey song, I Don't Know Names of Stuff? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a good one. Did you listen Could to that song it? I sent you? That RMR song? When, when, when did you send it to me? I've been in a black hole for about a week. It's been about a week? Probably not then. I haven't had my phone on. All because... that noise for one ice cube? <laughs> been like five days or so. All right, you got enough. Close the goddamn drawer. Oh, okay. Fuck, you got Whoa. someone working on your car in the kitchen? This kid's over here getting ice cubes. How many you need, Junior? Oh, oh, oh God. Oh, now he's got to get like, the flavor in. <laughs> Tell him to get me a beer. What are you tapping it for good luck? Pour the goddamn thing in there. Out of the goddamn kitchen, goddamn it. <laughs> goddamn kids. Damn kids. Damn kids, damn lawn. What were we talking about? Goddamn podcast. We were saying how uh, good it is to be back. Great to be back, guys. You know, <sighs> Sean and I were back last week. Yeah, and the computer ate Jeff's vocals. So it sounded like me That's talking like to myself. Still post it, and everyone should just guess and try to read Jeff's lips <laughs> and think of what he said. And try to figure it out from there. I can add just audio. Like, I'll just kind of think what I said. Do a voiceover, like read yeah. your own lips. Fuck, you said right. No so, one knows my lips it. like me. I know. Right. It. I, mean, I can't even see your lips. It's like you have lips. Trap. It's all up here. Got, got those little bird lips. See the power of my thoughts are. I'm right here. Oh, what's that yeah, movie? Yeah, so I we recorded. We we took an edible and uh, recorded a good what from 12, 12 o'clock at night till four in the morning. Yeah. Did everything just get really loud, or did I just get way more fucked up? What do you mean? I feel like everything just went to a different level. That's just me. That was just you, I'm buddy. Ready. I'll join you. Sean looked up to see if he could see the level. <laughs> Where is it? Uh, I, got, I got the audio the running out on the up monitor here. I gotta go two more up. Two more up. I'm gonna get to that level. <laughs> Ooh. Shoot for the that level right stars, now. guys. Cosmos. No, we told the story. Well, I told the story, and I want. Uh, Frankie to hear it. So this guy got in a fight with his neighbor, and they're pretty neighborly because they know some things about each other. So they got into this big argument. So the guy went home, and he dipped his fists in peanut butter because <laughs> he knew no. the guy had a nut allergy. <laughs> and went back over there his dukes. to fight his neighbor with peanut butter fists. <laughs> no. Fucking way. <laughs> Dude, this guy's trying to go to jail for attempted murder. The <laughs> fuck? Jeez. Peanut butter I fists. guess that's like a. That's it. No people, you know, and hey, Sean I, and I were saying no how, how, how it'd be oh. like the scene from fucking uh, Kickboxer. <laughs> He's fucking. He's trying to just. <laughs> just a chunky his, peanut butter. Peanut butter and glass. <laughs> honey, honey, where's the peanut butter? The chunky. <laughs> I'm the chunky guy. <laughs> I got nuts on my knuckle, knuckle nuts. Man, all we got's creamy. That's the name of the movie, old knuckle nuts. Wow, dude, that guess there's some crazy shit that's going down in your hood. You or what about the ghetto? Nut knuckles. People trying to fucking nut knuckle people. <laughs> <laughs> nut knuckle Yo, body. that kid's got a nut allergy. Grab that peanut butter. Oh shit! Get peanut butter, Holmes. Grab that. Give me, this give me the tube. Give me the They're tube of GIF. The schools are safe, bro. On the playground. No. <laughs> Give me that tube of GIF. <laughs> They're selling it by the tube. Dude, my daughter told me the craziest story about how her friend, she doesn't like this one girl at school. And we're like, why? She's like, she tried to cut me in half. <laughs> we're like, what? 
What is she, a magician? <laughs> She's like, no, she carries a knife everywhere, even at recess. <laughs> what? I said, what is it, a fucking prison check? <laughs> She's got a fucking toothbrush file down. I'm like, what do you like, mean? I'll she fucking carries cut a knife. You. Yeah, she carries a knife all day, even at recess. Now, this is a seven year old. <laughs> What's going Dude. on in that house? I'm telling you, oh, you my live in the straight hood. Is off the chain. Oh, I feel like she's not imagining things. I <laughs> bet there is a seven year old school. When I dropped off the computer, Jeff, the fucking story she was telling. Uh, Start writing some of these stories down, she, man. Get a book oh, going. I know. She. I mean. <laughs> She make there's a, there's a show called The Magicians. Maybe she, they had seven year olds on that show. Maybe. People maybe her dad's you know? David Copperfield. They just moved here from Las Vegas. <laughs> she you don't you, know that. She could be. She asked Jeff if she could go to the baseball field. Jeff said, No, wait till your mom gets home. He went to go take a dump or something, and she was gone. Comes, she comes back. From uh, I think my headphones just died. Uh oh. Nope, they're still here. <laughs> <laughs> she comes back. <laughs> oh shit! All right, we're, not, we're gonna keep going. Keep she going. Co- she comes back, and Frankie, it looks like she tried to take the entire baseball diamond home in her shoes. Yeah. It, I don't know how she her f- bases. I don't know how her foot was in her shoe. That's how much dirt was in the one. Like an inch of dirt in the bottom of her shoe. How? I don't know. That is a wild child. And uh, she came back, and I and I asked her why she couldn't. She, I, she, Jeff's like, why would you go to the baseball field when I told you to wait? She goes, I had to go. <laughs> I had, had to go. To. And, and I'm like, go, Dad. I'm like, what? You got a drug deal going down or something over there? Why? Why'd you have to go? No, I just well, had. You don't wait long. I just, I just had oh. to go. You had to go, man. She you know, She really has no filter. She did not give a fuck. She will tell you how it is, straight up. Like, no, I, I had to go. I know you said not to go, but I had to go. You understand now? Had okay. To go. I like just, she confirms it too. Laugh. She makes you say okay. We just laughed okay. about it. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Or And then she was telling the story about the fire, Jeff. Remember when it got burned by the fire? And we're like, what are oh, you yeah. talking about? The invisible fire, my friend. Help my friend. <laughs> Help me, Tom Cruise. It's so cute when she calls me fat. <laughs> Jesus. I was cuddling with her today, and we were watching. I'm like, Bella, you're such a little skinny mini. I'm like, you got to eat. Get some meat on these bones. Like, I know. I skinny and cute. She's like, you're, <laughs> you're, you're big daddy. <laughs> She's like, you're like, oh. a, cute, you're like a cute elephant. <laughs> oh, wow. so sweet. Wow. That is she the, that the, is the sweetest elephant. backhanded comment ever. Of a sour patch. Oh, she's game. fucking I've been saying lethal. She was born. No she's fucks armed. given, bro. So sharp. Like, she wanted to, like, eat, but she didn't really want to hurt you. You know what I'm saying? She didn't want to just say, Daddy, you super right. fat, but you still cute. Like, Daddy might be sensitive, so let's be careful. I mean, you she's look just like you're sensitive. Zingers. Oh, I'm sensitive. <laughs> I'm rough and tight, but I've got a sensitive side, too. I'm really know. sorry. <laughs> what was that voice? Are you hearing Old shit school? again, Sean? No, the voice Frankie made when he was doing this. Really sorry. What the hell was that? That's his, Ju- that's his Juliet Lewis from Old School. <laughs> you know, this is the close. My impression is not good enough for you. No. God damn it, cat. Look, here comes old. Oh. <laughs> Get out of here, cat. Scat. You're fucking you're, you're... Yeah. Does that work? Scat. It's not working. Shake something. I think all cats go running after stuff when you shake it, right? Send it on a commercial. <laughs> Careful with you your shit. see nothing but butthole in about two seconds. All in Jeff's face. It's what he lives for. Psst. Psst. 
off, Scat. cat. Rubbing on Stop my computer. Fucking around, cunt. Has there ever been a computer that a cat hasn't rubbed on? Get out of here, cat. Cat. Scat. <sighs> Go, mama. Do, 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 do. I'm Jesus. happy for Jeff. He's starting his uh, passion projects now. Yeah, hey, go check out our YouTube video. Editing videos. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, big mama. Oh. Oh, you're falling. I thought I was falling for a second. I was like, oh, shit, not again. Falling out of this chair. Not again. I miss you guys. I miss you boys, too. Oh. I miss you guys. We especially miss you, Frankie. Jeff and I see each other at least like once every week. Yeah. Man. Try to, at least. Yeah. I was I'm going to uh, uh, yeah. your place of business. Till it got shut down. They're back open. Yep. Oh, are they? Yeah. They finally paid and those, people off in those the, wars the their, their fair share. They got their monies. I'm a really good man, whore. Just ask your mama. <laughs> hey, your mama's in here. Oh, God, that, when they pull the fake fucking dicks out of their pants and he pulls out the Tootsie Roll. God damn it, that is just good. That's what your mama said after I bang her. What a great movie. Such a guy, yeah, it's been on lately, I haven't watched a bit. I haven't seen a good comedy in a long time. Long time, General? Long time. I, like I mean, I guess, this new movie I guess the time. new Borat was all right, from what I remember. Oh, you did watch that? Yeah, we watched it. I, yeah. Uh, we were going to do we a podcast it after it. I'm not really the biggest fan of Borat, to be honest. I wasn't like, oh, there's another one. Like it's, you're not even, it's, I was that excited. You're watching it for who he fucks with more than what he does. You're watching yeah, it for I the like reaction. He's like sitting down talking to people, and he's just like totally fucking with them, and they have no idea what's going on. Yeah. That's like the best part about it. When Like all know, the honestly, other like side story shit, I was like, eh, whatever. When the doctor... Is literally hitting on the daughter right in front of him. <laughs> like if your dad wasn't here, sure I'd fuck you. <laughs> it, like in uh, Real Geniuses, when she's there with her dad and the dude that she's fucking, and then she's like, "Can you? Uh, what's the line? Can you drive a railroad spike in with your hard penis?" And he's like, "What?" <laughs> Her fucking what boyfriend and her kids. You, you don't know the movie Real about? Geniuses? I don't know, bro. Sounds like that something fucking... I don't think I'd watch. That, that sounds like page 47 of the Pornhub. <laughs> looking for the... Yeah, you went too far. Oh. You, you guys don't... The... Will they build the laser? Oh, now nah, you're definitely in a... What What do you type in the categories? What, what kind of fever dream <laughs> are you living in? <laughs> Hold on, dude. This is bizarre like, cosmos laser porn. <laughs> got a real phone on him right now. Mine's looking at me. I feel like you need to type in that movie and look at it. And you real genius with Va with Val Kilmer. Yeah. Where they fill the dude's house with popcorn and shoot it with the laser. Yes, yes. That, that's that's where they're in. They're that house, that dude's house, where that chick's like going downstairs and he's hitting on her and he's like right in front of her dad and the dude that she, they're there, he she's fucking him. And she's like, a girl's got to have her standards. You got to fucking, what, you never fucking pounded a railroad spike in with your penis? No. What do you do on Tuesdays? Not that. I go to sleep early. Take my multivitamin. Yes. Oh, I did forget you. The gray, you're getting old. Man, you need to start living a little. My I'm railroad telling you, spike Tuesdays are over. <laughs> <laughs> got to be honest. I think there's a pill for that. Or like a... A chew, a gum, maybe? Yeah, Blue uh, Chew. Not a sponsor. Maybe. Not a sponsor. <laughs> John's brother knows all about those. But hey, Blue Chew, <laughs> if you want to... Blue Chew or Roman, if you want to hook us up with some dick pills and a nice sponsor check, we're in. I'll try them out. <laughs> I'll try them. Frankie, you have no What's girlfriend and you live alone. What are you going to do? What do you mean you're going to try them out? You mean drilling holes like in those, the wall. <laughs> I can feel like those guys they call pimps and go pick up a couple fatties at the park. Oh, yeah, that's that's true. But, two of them. Yeah, but they got to have, have two COVID tests to make sure they can come in the house. 
Yeah, I mean, <laughs> shit, I got time, bro. I got I got all the time in the world to go get fatties. That's, that's you a, that's just, a, you gotta just sit there naked on the leather until your <laughs> results come back. <laughs> you ever just rub your leather? Frank is over there shaking the bag like a Polaroid pitcher. <laughs> All right, lady number two, you got I'm testing go. the crack. Hold on, lady let me make one. sure that this shit's good. Lady hold one. on, hold on. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. So what you chill? Hungry you can line them all up. Test I'm them. just joking. You know I love fat ladies. Keep your, <laughs> keep your mask on. I like to go out and eat. Man, I need a girl that can eat too. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a salad and I'll save it for later. None of that bullshit. Cause I like variety, you know what I'm saying? So like, I want to order six things, and then if she orders a couple, I could, you know. And don't tell me you're not hungry, and then you're gonna start eating my fries. <laughs> I asked I you, if you, you weren't, weren't hungry. Some, bitch. <laughs> well, that was, you know, the new McDonald's commercial. Hungry. Have you seen it? No. The black, the black dude pulls up in the truck. I don't want anything. He's like, all right, no problem. Give me two quarter pounders. She have, she opens the bag, grabs one out of it. It's like, I thought you didn't want anything. She goes, you ordered two. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, always order fries. Go, don't you? Always order Isn't fries. Like two for five? Always order that, I mean, that's fries. the golden rule. If you're going to be around anyone and you go to McDonald's, you need to order extra fries because someone's going to fucking, they're not Give even going to come around yeah, you two fucks. To. Yeah, Give you're not fry. even asking. We go fry. You can have my fries. You just got to be tested first. Just put your head Anytime. back. Anytime. Fra- you Frank, you know, in all honesty, so got- you order so much shit, all we got to do is sit back and wait for you to be like, oh, I don't want any more of this or any more of this or any yeah, more of this. Just wait, like vultures. Uh, just, uh-huh. I circle your plate. I feel like I'm down. Sean, down he's I'm slowing wait. down. He's almost done with those mozzarella sticks. <laughs> He's almost done with those loaded left. nachos from Chili's. Ooh, and look at the queso nachos. That's not, right, I still am motherfucker. You know, I drove the big star last week. Motherfuckers are closed. God, fucking. Yeah, it dude. says open on the fucking internet. That's an hour out there. They're fucking closed. Oh, so you, did you go to the spot instead and get the same damn thing? I don't, I don't even think I ate that night. I came home. I was that. I was that disappointed. Just came home. You just went to bed hungry. You're like, fuck went to you bed hungry. I went, got some at Indica and said, night, night time. I, mean, I got right. some shit that's like 33. percent Woo! I need five large fries. Me on my. What about ass. my water? You know what's great is when the kids <laughs> like I go to McDonald's and I'll like I'll be the one to make the run, so I will get everyone's order. And you can't wait till you get home to eat the fries, you know? You got to dip oh, up yeah. in that bag. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Taste I, them. I put you know, my hand sure. right in the kids' fries. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi, daughter. The same house. What time is it? One twelve <laughs> in the morning. Okay, Belle. Thank you. You look cold in your jean jacket. Love you. Good night. Oh, See, I'm saying like, straight savage. Oh, One months, in the fucking morning. Are you kidding me? He looks like a hillbilly I, from 1986 made a time machine out of I his fucking his Dodge Dart. See, I paint the wall in my trailer light colors so it looks bigger. <laughs> uh, I got to open the space up. There is a movie, <laughs> I think, and it's like. You know, all your friends that have kids are just like, they tell you how great it is. Oh, man, it's so great. Like, you wait till you have kids, like, when you'll understand, and it's so great, it's so amazing. And then, like, you have kids, and then you ask those same people, like, is it supposed to be this bad? And they're like, well, it gets better. People that are telling you how amazing it was before, but now it's, well, it'll get better. (laughs) It'll never get better. No, I mean, it never maybe does. when they're 18, when they move out, I bet that's the time they're talking about her. I mean, well, when shit, you see I, them grow and they're experiencing, you're like, God, I can't wait till she does this, or I can't wait till they do this. And then when they do it, like, I can't like, wait till she fucking it. goes to bed. Then it becomes, I wish you would shut the fuck up for three minutes. I can't <laughs> wait till she stands up, and then she's standing up, taking everything off the countertop, <laughs> side of the floor. And it's and like, God, I can't for, wait oh, so I wish she can walk, couldn't. and now you got to chase her around. God See, that sounds it. super awesome. I feel like I've yeah. done that with a bunch of different it's women's awesome. kids. Oh, 
Frankie. I'm just saying. Stepdaddy. I'm a Funkel. Me too. You know yeah, you're saying? a Funkel, bro. That's what I do best. Uncle the kids aren't missing all their sugar highs from when <laughs> Uncle Frankie came over with Bag bags of, candy, of Skittles. Yeah. <laughs> it's Halloween every I, I, night. I, I just do that every time just to be – I mean, I get it. It's, like, nice for the kids to get candy when I come over. It's just to piss you and Kayla off. Like, hey, here's a yeah. bunch of sugar for the kids. I know they don't need it. Bella's going to be up till 2 a.m. without the sugar, but at least now she'll be up to 4. I know. She needs, like, a warm glass of milk. <laughs> Maybe with, I'll need with, some milk uh, with, so Where do you get that stuff? Warm glass with of three Tylenol pill, PMs in it. <laughs> right. You want a night night gummy? She's on her sixth one. She's fucking not even. She's double down. fisted the containers right now, just <laughs> chugging them down. Unbelievable. I got uh, Mama Cupcake is over here. Go away, cat. Pussy we'll all, ah, all around you. You're a pussy magnet. Yeah, Christ. Almighty. It must be the jean ah, jacket. Bitch. He's clawing me. This is great. Oh, shit, man. How many animals are you going to have in the house with you? God damn, I'm just curious. Right now. How many cats do you have? Two. Two. By your ma. One. What about dogs? Three, she four. Two. Three. I have one. One for the see. I'm not good with the numbers no more. You're gonna be uh -huh. like fucking. Not good with numbers. It's four plus one. Three and three, buddy. All right, two dogs, one dog, three dogs. It's three cats, three dogs. Oh, that's a, that's a half a dozen there. Is that a baker's dozen? What's a baker's yeah. dozen? Is that twelve? Thirteen. Thirteen. That doesn't make any sense. That's why it's a, a baker's, baker's dozen. dozen's 13? Yes. Yeah. I thought a baker's dozen was six. The Dude, half I've dozen. Been, I've been killing it with the dad this jokes lately. Time. You're a dad. Look at you. I oh, was I telling him about the, the lady who went to the fucking bee farm. She, she, ordered, she ordered 12 bees. She looked in the box and there was 13. She said, you gave me an extra one. She goes... That one's a freebie. <laughs> wow. Hey, next time you go to the store, when you push your cart, like when you're pushing your cart back in, if someone grabs <sighs> it from you, you say, hey, I left a little gas in it for you. <laughs> do you do that? Is that something that I get to look forward to? You I'm gonna, do. I'm going to tell, I'm gonna tell you right now. If I, I went, I if someone gave that. Know, our listeners Following, tune in for comedy, you cocksuckers. Not these fucking trash dad jokes. Do you understand me? You're better than this. What? I just wanted to get that off my chest. Why don't you get the cock off your chest, guy? Oh no, that's where that's how I shaved my. One chest of the there. kids came home from school and said, "You want <clears throat> to see my essay?" And I said, "I didn't know you had any Spanish friends." <laughs> dad joke. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. <laughs> they rolled their eyes. Come on, kitten. Come on Did back. They get it that quick? They knew what it, they knew what an essay is. They're like about the local homes forever. Yeah, this cat. They watch American Me what every morning cat? before school. Ah, just oh. bit me. Fuck. Lay down. <laughs> <laughs> Why would your own cat bite you Rough. for no reason? I want to know. I want to know. I feel like that's what I heard in my head when I said it. It's I, I want to rock. Yeah. I know, but it was like but you want in my know. head when I said it. I want to know. What was that? I want to know what love is. <laughs> that song should be playing at all times little, when you walk into a room right now with that outfit two, you're wearing. You just combined two different songs. <laughs> You just combined I want to rock with I want to know what love is. You had White Snake and Twisted know. Sister just <laughs> fucking co-mingle. I want you to show me. I like remixes. Oh, and, th and then some Foreigner in there, too? You want to hear, you wanna hear something you talking about an actual hilarious? Foreigner? What's that? What's, what, tell me another um, dad joke, please. The, <laughs> what's the song, Sean? The Wind of Change? 
Yes. I honestly thought the beginning of that song was in French. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know the song. Je no sais no quoi. <laughs> Don't do pompy <laughs> <laughs> Follow the demo squad down to Gorky Park. I honestly, for like I'm fucked up. I don't know what's happening years, right now. I thought that song was the beginning was French. <laughs> Follow the he demo the squad <laughs> down to Gorky right. Park. Listening. What is to, it again? Follow the demo squad down to Gorky Park. I absolutely love that song. Listening and I thought to it was the French the of part. change. <laughs> They're like German French number music. one. And it's a song about the Berlin Wall coming down. <laughs> so you're so why would it be in why would on, it be what in radio French? stations are you guys listening to? What do you mean? You've never heard the song Wind of Change? By the Scorpions? You call yourself an American? By the fucking I mean, Scorpions? A lot of people call themselves American. The beginning really is in French. <laughs> it is, no, it's, it's in not. English. <laughs> I just found out it's not in French. <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh, can you guys think? Oh, there's the other one I yeah. thought. That Rob Zombie song, More Human Than a Human. Yeah. I didn't I didn't know the name of the song, and I thought it was just one of those, like, cl- clever songs where you just make noises with your <laughs> mouth. <laughs> I seriously thought the hook was... It turns out it's more More human than than human. human. I just sing what I hear, bro. Just sing what you feel. I don't have time to look up the lyrics. I'm sorry. (laughs) I say what I hear. I'm just saying. When I'm in my car, I'm fucking singing full out whatever I feel. You know what I'm so saying? If you that's ever what I think it is. More human than a human was ball zoop me, baby zoop me. <laughs> Probably not. I mean, like, I'm thinking you of wind change was in French. <laughs> Did you, what, you think it was a, <laughs> what, you think he was trying to sell Zubas in some fucking foreign language? I don't know. Maybe Buy Zubas, yeah, the I'm Zubas. Like well, dude, there's literally a song where the, the, the chorus is the guy humming. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, and the name of the song knows, is anything's mm-hmm, possible right? by the Crash Test Dummies. <laughs> I, I used mm-hmm. to think there was a song where he was just making noises. It was that corn song. It was like, mm-hmm. yeah, he is just making noises. <laughs> oh, he <yeah. laughs> What the fuck do you think he's saying there? <laughs> What's the lyric of that song? What is it saying? Mm, bop the, mm, it bop the, oh. What the fuck is they yeah, saying? Yeah, but <laughs> when you I go to the like lyric, it's a Hanson remix. When mm, you go to bop. the lyric, when you go to the <laughs> lyric, how's how's that corn thing written? Uh, <laughs> boom clap. I need to look <laughs> up. M M M. Look up the lyrics. B A A P. G A D. G A T. I mean, it's not my snowboard mix. Is that pretty good? A boom, knock, knock, boom, knock, 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 boom. Yeah, 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 I feel like you got it. <laughs> Sounds like a bad a truck trying to start in the winter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Did you guys heard. think of any lyrics that you totally fucked up? I just did tell you what I thought. That, no. I, I fuck up lyrics all the time. What do you mean? Every song I've ever sang? <laughs> what do you, you think I know all these lyrics? I felt like there was one recently we figured out that you didn't know. Fucked up something right now that I didn't know. Oh, dude, there's so much. It was recent. God damn, I wish I could remember it. It was a good one. (laughs) Like a well-known fucking pop hit. I feel like I I (laughs) remember. Yeah, I feel like I remember this too now. Now it's going to drive me crazy, you asshole. John, anything? Nah, I got nothing. You just know the lyrics. So I'll look that shit I, up. I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell you, I, I never. Plus he speaks Fran- French. I never knew. Like I never heard BTS 
that the boy the Korean boy band. And I'm uh, I've a Korean boy band. There, there's a Korean boy band called BTS. And they have a song so called. I know it's Sean's been listening. No, now no. You perked my interest. I'm walking through the store and I always fucking hear it. So I'm just like, you always want to kind of see like a visual to the person singing it. Yeah. Like you want to see what Bob Seger looks like singing, you know, and shit like that. That's I'm not like that curious. Like Cootie I and the that Blowfish. That shit like, yeah. So I'm like, I fell asleep with MTV videos on or some bullshit, or I woke up with. Wait, that MTV's still on TV? There's a channel. A thing? There's a channel they that has video? that has videos. Yes. What? And these Korean cyborgs came on TV <laughs> singing the song because they all look the fucking were, same. How high were you at this point? I just um, woke up. Wait, I just woke up. So from a coma, from a weed coma. <laughs> It's this, probably the song called Dynamite. I swear to God, I didn't know it was by those guys. And I'm sure you've heard it, Jeff, because you have a little kid. Maybe. It's just called Dynamite. Boy bands? Light it up dynamite. like dynamite. Those are all Korean kids. That wait, wait, just wait, wait, wait. How's it English. go? I want to hear you sing. I don't really ever get to hear you sing. How's it go? I, I can't. Like I almost... I, we can't. We can't. You can. We can't. Frankie sang a boom, knock, knock, boom, knock, knock, knock. Dude, it's my impression of it. I'm just trying to get my point across. I yeah, can there you go. Drink some water. Things. Coat the throat. Get ready. Coat the throat. <clears throat> I'm not singing. Don't worry, me, Faso Latino. But how did it go? Can you talk it to me? It just goes light it up like dynamite. Oh. Yeah. That see? sounds like a boring song. It was on a commercial. Yeah. That's, that's why I was like. commercial where everyone's like dancing. I love that one. Oh. Is that like kind of like Firework by Katy Perry? Getting like a wrecking ball. I can't that's, do that. That's that's wrecking ball. That was Wrecking Ball. <laughs> what do you mean? I like the Firework one too. I just don't remember the lyrics, all right? Do you ever feel? Oh, I love that song. It's like I one of my favorites. Know. Yeah, you don't even know the lyrics to. There is a song that's called Cold. Couldn't tell you who the fuck sings it, but I really like it. Good. Not Crossfade, but I like that one too. Is it Cold by Coldplay? No, that's how I know you're gay. Because you macrameed oh. yourself a pair of jean shorts? I feel like... Man. Yeah. Uh, got like a kink in my neck from like sitting... I know my drink's empty. Yep. I know I'm a fucking. Uh, and we're. We need close to the end of our hour. Oh my god! Rush mints. I still thirsty. Kids, are these, all these kids are still up. Don't you let that fridge slam! God damn it! Don't you slam my fridge! Slam my car door! God damn it! I think they I'm need. Fuckers always be slamming my car door. I'm gonna be fucking. You're gonna need two hands, Junior. You'll be oh, walking around shit. with three shoes, two on your feet, and one, one in your, your ass. ass. Maybe I don't need to drink anymore. I was like, I got some Jameson here, but. Why not? I'm in Rome, bro. Podcast is back. Only to get better. Have water break be in between. Only to yeah, get better. Yeah, it's pure vodka. Yeah, but what if you mix. Vodka and water. Then you have a vodka and water. Then you can just keep pounding them. I mean, that's just called Uh-oh. genius. Daughter's you know what kind of night it's going to be when dinosaur. Jeff walks into the bar and he's all like, can I get a vodka water? Oh, fuck. You know he's got Mio in his pocket. Not a sponsor. Could be, though. You know what I'm saying? Or Could any other any other juice company that wants to sponsor us by spraying Anyone want to sponsor us at all? I'll put anything in my vodka. For a nickel. That's true. <laughs> That's a lot of shit you'll do for a nickel. I'm just it saying. Came full circle. Back to the nickel. Nickels must be like in high demand or something. If you get a rare like... nickel, it's worth more than five cents. Did you <laughs> never it... did you ever see the movie UHF? The guy yeah. asking for change? Finds the rare coin. He bought himself a Rolex with it. Wow. That's what I'm saying. Really? 
only rare coins. What if you just found like one coin that was like from the 1700s and it was like super rare and it was worth like a million dollars? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm sure it's happened. I'm sure it's happened. They find custom paintings at fucking garage sales and shit. Right. Millions. Don't know. You gotta be educated. Right. I'd walk past that painting and be like, "That looks like shit." (laughs) Someone else knows. And some asshole (laughs) fucking signed it on the bottom. Right. That beat off. Thinks he did a good painting. Fucking Michelangelo can suck it. (laughs) (laughs) Hey Picasso, Picasso, he's nuts. You're a great turtle. Picasso. Painter, not so much. Stick to karate, kid. Uh, but someone told him. Wait, isn't that another thing? Did someone tell me they're coming out with a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Yeah, you oh, brought this super up high. the last time we did a podcast five months ago. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I mean, my state of mind, bro. That's where I'm at. I'm just waiting for this movie. You wait a long Is time, it man. Long, long time, bro. Movie theaters are dead. I'm still waiting for Fast 9, you know what I'm saying? I just saw they, there's some movie that's coming out on Friday, and it's only in theaters. So we went, Movie theaters are dead. Who's, who's going to the movies right now? Let's Our whole state's new, on uh, the new oh, wait, We're not Wonder on a lockdown. It's going to be in theaters and on HBO. Oh, yeah, you could pay like 20 bucks to get it on TV now. It's like this is bullshit. I could have paid... I mean, I guess it's kind of worth it. But right, but HBO for free. So if you have HBO, you can see it, or you got to see it in the theater. So that's pretty cool. That services are, I mean, it sucks if you don't have HBO. Then you have to go to the theater, or right. else you can wait. See, I don't know about you guys. My phone literally, like, Monday, put out a statewide, it's not a lockdown. It's called a stay-at-home. Yeah. It's, cause it'd be locked it's down what you guys have been on out. since fucking February. Yeah. How dare you? No, like, like stuff's Keep been it open home. and shit. I'm just saying, though, like, they're making it to where it's, like, a statewide thing now, where, like, all all it's just essential businesses again and stuff like that. All the businesses are closed down again. Speaking, and dude. Yeah, no. I just hope everyone's, like, see, this is, I, I miss this. This is safe. I mean, I really don't like sometimes you guys smell. I'm just, I mean, I, oh, my. Well, we got to figure out what we're going to do, because, I mean, we only got one more weekend of the den. The den's going bye-bye. The place this I mean, all started. I'm selling my house for anyone who doesn't know. That's oh what we were talking man. about the animals before, because I'm moving back in with my mother. Moving on up. And our animals are going to combine and fight. No, I'm not. But I am selling you my place. Dream. We close on the 10th it. of December, and I will be moving back in with my mother. Until we find a place of permanent residence, I will keep I feel everyone like you're posted. Super, super excited! I can just hear it. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, this was a nice. It was a nice place for a starter place. I'm happy Dude, with it. I like if it. If you here. can make the money that you want to make, an actual them? house. You want a yard? Go for it. It's a great condo, yeah. but I want my own shit. I don't like people right up my ass next to me, all over. I'm right. surrounded they can by find uh, out people. You have a peanut allergy, and then they come right. over with peanut butter fists. <laughs> fucking. You can't be knuckles. having that. Ar- you can't be having peanut butter knuckles. fists running around. Yeah. <laughs> you can't be raising kids in a fucking neighborhood like that. I get it. Try to take them out the hood. Bunch of peanut butter yeah. fist having motherfuckers. You guys are good parents. So that's what's I, going I, on. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome, though. I mean, just make sure that they build a, a en suite, you know, like a in-law suite at the new mansion for me. Yeah, well. In the, just in the, you know. You're going to be my commander, corner. boy. I'm going to get a pool house for you. <laughs> Even better, pool house? That means there's a pool, right? There's got to be a pool for there to be a pool house? Yeah. How, how big of a pool? Like turtle-shaped blue ones? ones? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's one of those... One of those fun times playhouses, the plastic ones. Yeah. I'm in. I right mean, next to one of them turtle sandboxes. Right, it's a pool, right? Is that That's the way Walmart sells them. Like, hey, it says pool. $10. Yo, before we end this, did you, see, ten bucks? did you see on Amazon you can buy tiny houses to build in your backyard? Yeah. I mean, you could buy it at Home Depot. Where, from fucking Ikea? On Amazon, you talk about you, I got to build it myself. 
on Amazon, you could buy a tiny home to build in your backyard. That's pretty cool. But you already have a house in a backyard. Yeah. So I don't know why you'd build I mean, a- some people have big backyards. You know what I'm saying? I guess you could stick your mother in there. Right. I mean, I feel like we should just buy a neighborhood. How much is the neighborhood going for? We uh, really should look that up. More than we got. We should just mm. buy, like, build a skyscraper. And just put, I know, like, I'm just saying, if I keep, in, like, all 70 floors, you know? I'm down to buy a skyscraper. I'm just going to make sure I hit on another parlay this weekend, and we're good. I'm telling you guys, you need to move to Illinois where you can sport bet. It, sports has never been so interesting. I bet I'm a can, golfer. Dude, I, I have to week. drive. I can put my bets in. All I got to do is drive to Illinois. Yeah, I mean. It's so stupid. You got to drive it. past I, an imaginary past the border. fucking field. I'll go to McDonald's and get a sausage. We're egg literally and right on the border. I could drive. That's what I'm saying, bro. And make a we bet. Need to, we need to buy that old steakhouse that's over there on 12. And we'll turn that into a sports viewing bar. Let's take my idea now. Someone will take it. It's a really good idea. I'm just saying. You just uh, One of these times on one of these great ideas, you just got to act. Yeah. Act on I, one of them. I got I got an idea. You know what? Now I got some extra time on my hands. I'm gonna hit up. I need a business partner and uh, good. You know, a good guy I know, uh, Dwayne Johnson. I'm gonna hit him up and see if he wants to maybe possibly do something together, collaborate, and you know, I it's would. a really really good idea. Yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna hit him up next. I just I just you know you know how I am with social media and getting around yeah. and stuff like that. It's just I'm I'm just not you know. I know. I know when he called you to be in Jumanji, welcome to the jungle, and you're like, sorry, like COVID, I can't do it. Yeah, I'm not you know, my family right comes now. first, so yeah. you're going to play the monkey boy that plays with his butthole. <laughs> Could I probably would have killed cool. that part. I'm just saying. I haven't seen it yet, but I bet you I would have killed that role. You would have killed it. Killed it. I mean, he you played guys, it good, but he just didn't go for it like you would have. Right. No. I mean, I, well, I got more experience probably. It's just, you know what I mean? It's kind of a thing you got. When, you, when you're when you acting, you want it to be as natural as possible. Exactly. <laughs> I got nothing. What do you what mean? You don't naturally play with your bow? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, bro. It's the 21st. Is How high would you century? have to be to put something up your ass? Trust me, I've been with some pretty beautiful fifth. women, and I the hell plead the fifth. I plead the fifth, bro. That is a no enter. No matter what, <laughs> I don't give a fuck how hot she is. I plead the Bitches fifth. be trying too. They thought they were slick. I'm like, ah. Uh-huh. Right I don't give a fuck. Buttholes tight at all. You time. be standing there like you got the I ate ass face. Everyone be pushing your shit. Kevin Hart, goddamn, he's fucking, he's goddamn man. All Star Comedy Jam. What are we doing here? Sean that 2009, right. 2011. That's it. Louis the fifth. Sean, don't eat ass. I'm not putting that out there. All right. Oh, fuck. They're looking like you got the E8 <laughs> ass face right that just, now. No bullshit. That Sean, just kills so- I'm fucking. He just starts rubbing his beard. <laughs> Ah, fuck. Ah. It's out there now. That just killed someone's Christmas present, you motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, with that being said, <sighs> fucking A, it was like, good to be get back. Him something, that's a present. Thank you all for listening. Come on back it's next like week, hopefully, for another fun filled episode of The Gentleman's Den. Thanks. Hey. Still there? You should go to shop.spreadshirt.com backslash the hyphen gentleman's hyphen den. Buy a t shirt. Hey, maybe it's maybe a coffee mug. Hey, I'm I'm pretty sure there's a one a touching shirt on there. No, Christmas no, gifts. There's not. not. Think of your mother this Christmas. I'm gonna post it. Think of your mother. Your mother loves oh, you. Geez. All right, have a safe and happy holidays, y'all. We'll see you next week. Don't eat too much. Later.